Alright everybody, welcome back to some more Corpse Party. Last episode, I mean, we stabbed and may have killed Naomi because she burnt her paper offering for the Sachigo charm. Yeah. Let me fucking blows because I like Naomi and I don't like Na Ayumi, but... <clears throat> what it is, what it is. Oh, that's the way we came. Alright, so, let's go down this way. New Corpse. It appears to be of a small child. Why didn't it... Did I already do this one? Oh, right there. Wait, I thought I said it was a small child. Died in a sleep alongside a beloved, age 17. Maybe that's not the right school. Huh. Oh, that's weird. It must be a glitch or something. It must seem to be... Whatever. Let's read it. Strange but true, chasing down the hidden... Okay, so this is going to be three. I shouldn't be alone. I shouldn't be alone. We're not the first to come here. It seems there have been many, many before us. And I'm also, just a heads up, I am using my alternate mic, so I might, I might sound a little different from previous episodes. And every one of them has either died or been swallowed up by the, swallowed up by the school itself. I'm not simply using the word swallowed for magic of a feather. It is regrettably an apt description. There's a massive curse encompassing this entire building. It's like an entity unto itself, and it slowly devours the souls of men. It chips away at a person's core, sanity, reason, even identity, eventually destroying him. Nothing that made him who he is remains. Once it's gripped your heart, you'll quickly succumb to despair and loneliness. The sense of what makes you human is literally eaten away, as if by worms. When this happens, your body begins to necrotize and your soul becomes black as spent ash. We've come to regard this process as darkening. And whoever succumbs to the darkening itself, or become... Let me read that. And whoever succumbs to the darkening becomes an inseparable part of the school itself. In rare instances, one may be to avoid the full act of darkening, instead faded to be seared unbearably by intense violent thoughts and emotions. Most of the time, souls will be rooted here, cursed to one of these halls for eternity, with no hope of passing or exorcism. Thus, my use of the word swallowed, the school swallowed us whole, growing fatter with tortured souls every day. It makes me shudder just thinking about it. The means by which I've come here. The Sachiko charm. And if a particular's ever got out into the mainstream, this school would never go hungry again. To anyone who may be reading this fourth installment, soon the fifth, it's clear you're a victim trapped in the hellish place, just as I am. The least I can do is give you some advice. Keep you alive as long as possible. If you have still even the dimmest shred of hope, hang on to it. Keep it firmly in your heart. Never give up on it. I can't stress that enough. I hope you'll be looking forward to part five. My assistant, the Gucci. Ta Gucci has disappeared somewhere. Now that I'm by myself, I can no longer go home. So, I'm just going to keep writing. It is my one true calling, after all. No matter what happens, as long as there's a little life left in me, as long as my hands can still move, I will never stop writing. Alright. Oh. Okay, I guess I have to switch. Alright. I don't know what I'm looking for. Hmm? I just went... Okay. Hmm, what's this? One envelope existing prominently at pot top atop the body of Naho and Kabiki definitely wasn't there before. Too dark to see what's in here. Let's step outside and take a look. It's a photograph. <laughs> what the fuck is it? What are you freaking out about? Show us! No. No, it can't be. The photograph in the envelope clearly depicts Yuka, and she doesn't look well. <laughs> oh, 
Oh. Okay. Shishido is dead. I don't remember if she lives or not. Uh, died of loneliness? Oh shit, I'm fucked. <laughs> anyway. Um, what's this? Anything written on it? No. I don't like how dark it, or how quiet it is in here. Holy shit. There's literally no sound in this bitch. This is not editing. I have nothing in here. I'm getting the fuck out of here, bro. I don't like this room. Was that a fucking pentagram? This room seems to be set up for black magic or witchcraft or something. Yeah, it doesn't... Well, what's happening? My, my head... My head is throbbing! Why isn't anyone coming to help me? I don't know, Yumi. Because you're a fucking psychopathic bitch! A nosebleed? Now? God! I need a tissue. As Yumi pulls a tissue from her pocket, she inadvertently pulls it, pulled out her student ID as well. It slipped from her hand and immediately fell down through a hole in the floor. As if so Well, is it karma? i bitch, Yumi! You fucking 100% deserve that shit. Why? Why? Karma, baby. My student ID. My paper doll scrap. Yeah, good luck apologizing Naomi now, bitch! Wait, she is alive? What the fuck? Shinozaki, am I ever glad to see you? And alive, no less. Nishishido, I, I, I can't. I'm sorry. I made a terrible mistake, but I'll be a good girl from now on. So please forgive me. What are you talking about? Come on, over here. There's nothing to be afraid of anymore. Is this really Miss Shishido? I can't see. It really is you. Where have you been all this time? We've been worried sick. I could have sworn she was dead. I'm so sorry. It must have been terrifying in here all by yourself. I mean, it sounds like her. Oh god, Miss Shishido, you're injured. Pretty severely too from the looks of it. Oh yeah, she did live, didn't she? Because... The, the the ghost pushed the cabinet and then didn't kill me and then I got up and was like alright peace out man <laughs> my arm is in bad shape Shinozaki come on stand up we're getting out of here Miss Shishido! Miss Shishido! Oh man, she really just died? Come on! You're almost there! She better not fucking die! She getting shot? What the fuck just happened? Miss Shishido! Miss Yui! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I can never take back what. Ah, oh, here comes the regret. You don't deserve pity. Miss Yui, um... I'm so unless she's sorry that she did the Sachiko Ever After thing. But she's only sad now because she can't get out. Where the hell are you? What are you doing? Why aren't you responding? At least write me back for God's sake. You're texting him? Oh. If you really did follow me here, then show your damn face already. You didn't follow your dumbass. Oh. Wait a second. Oh no. Not him. That's not him.
And if it is him, it's no longer the guy you know. We just learned about darkening five minutes, not even. According to my re yeah, recording two or three minutes ago. Fuck. Do you have any idea how worried I've been? If you don't respond to my texts, how am I supposed to know you're alright? Do you have no services? Did you run out of batteries? Mm-hmm. Satoshi, you are right. Gashi, Yuka's not dead. Is she? Fuck, man, this is not going good. Yuka, she was probably scared out of her mind. Okay, we can still escape this with Naomi and Satoshi. I don't give a fuck about Na Ayumi, and it looks like uh, Kishinuma uh, Sir came to the darkening and is now an evil sound bitch. She was probably scared and out of her mind. It's so salvageable. And in a lot of pain. And I wasn't there for her. All alone. Don't blame your... It's not your fault, Satoshi. The fuck? It's... Not your fault. So, why did Psycho just call out? Well, whose fault is it then? Whose fault is it, Naomi? Huh? Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it! Show yourself! Who the fuck you are? You must be get, getting a really good laugh out of us watching us suffer! I butchered this. I'm eating. Satoshi! What is it? What just happened to glance out the window at the covered walkway between the two buildings. And I saw a red dress. What? Goddamn piece of shit, little girl. I'm gonna make him pay for what she's done. You have no right messing with the living. Oh shit! Tashi, wait! Hold it right there, Sa Sachiko! What? Satoshi, Satoshi, what is happening? <laughs> Satoshi, Satoshi, pull yourself together. What happened to you? He was. He was fine like half a second ago. Naomi, I'm sorry. I'm not going to make it. Why did Yuka die? What the fuck? What are you talking about? What's gotten into you? Can can no one be saved? I've lost my will to live. Don't say that! This is my paper claw scrap. I want you to have it. Satoshi, no! You need to find Shinozaki. Sin Hold on a second, uh, Satoshi. Sinozaki is not going to let her go home. Especially when she finds out she let Satoshi get, kill himself or do whatever. You need to find Shinozaki. And then go home. Stop talking like that! Don't give up! If you need a reason to keep on living, then I'll give you one! The nuts. Do it for me, damn it! For living for me! No. Where the fuck is she? Look, this is all happening so fucking fast. Where are we now? Miss Yui is dead. What? I'm upset right now. Why the fuck? Okay, I like Naomi, so I'm glad she's living. But everyone is dead. Kishinuma must have came to the fuck. 
Nakashima? Where did you get that paper doll scrap? Is it Mochita's? Oh no. No, Tatashi still has his own. This is Yuka's. Poor girl. She didn't make it either. Hmm. So that means there are there are two between the both of you. Oh, you fucking bitch. I know exactly what she's about to do. Oh, come on, Naomi. Mean, you can take her. Look at this little shrimp. Come on. Do a little, a little, uh, a little uh, give him the two piece and a biscuit. Naomi, mean, you better fucking not lose. She is like four, nine. 80 pounds soaking wet. Sorry to ask, but can I have that one? You're a real jackass, you know that? Take her, Naomi. Soccer one. Right in the throat. Hit her, fucking break her trachea. Stab it in half. Bow. Actually, I'm only asking because I wound up losing mine. So, give it here! Sucker punch. Damn it. Take her, Naomi. Bruh. Check it out, Mochita. I killed her. I killed her. Killed her. Killed her. Killed her. Killed her. Killed her. I killed, 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 killed her. Killed her, dead. I'm actually sweating from having to fucking voice Ayumi. The filthy pig is gone now! You're free to be with me! Come on, let's get out of here together! Sorry, Nakashima. Looks like I get the guy after all. You sucker punched her! It's not a fair fight! She wasn't expecting you. Ah, uh, she shouldn't have lost that. The darkening. No! No, 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 no! Really? No one's gonna survive? Wait. The Mochita's not with me. Then how do I get back home? You don't, bitch. You just killed your lifeline. No. That's... Womp womp womp. The night's big loser! Ayumi! By the way, it doesn't matter what end I get. Um, I'm not gonna play this again. This is if the, I think there's a fixed ending, but... Because there's nothing else I could really feel like I do differently. Um, and I will be talking about the games that will be replacing this at the end of the episode, so hang around for that. Pardon? What the fuck? Uh... I'm not supposed to find out Yuki's dead. Yuki's dead. Okay. 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 I gotta. I can't find out Yuki's dead because if I do. Sit all right, so I know what you're wondering right now. You're like, Barton, isn't this the start of chapter five? It is. 
Um, guess what? Uh, in order to progress through chapter 5, Yuka can't get fucking caught. I know, right? Fuck me. <sighs> if Yuka gets caught, you're stuck in that... From what I understand, I, I there's not much information about this game, but I watched a couple videos, and all of them began with him escaping with Yuka. So, off camera... Um, unless something new appears, I will be evading him. Um, and I have to go through all that bullshit again. Luckily, I don't have to reread it. But it looks like, um, if I escape him, everything changes. So, let's go ahead and do that. So, let's skip all this fucking... Let's skip all this. So, I'm just supposed to run away from him. See, if I was being chased, I'd already be dead. Oh. So, Sachiko blocks my way, so I gotta juke him. Skrrr! Get juke, bitch. Okay, so now I gotta run for my fucking life. From what I understand, you're supposed to just roam the halls. And then after this, everything sure, if there's anything new, I'll record it. Oh, fuck no. Oh shit, he's coming. He's coming, fam. I gotta go. Fam booty! Please don't be a dead end. Oh shit. Uh, this way. I can go over the right. I can. Oh, thank god. Oh, I got a fucking. More, I got more shits. Ah! Oh, shitty titties. What the fuck? No! Oh, God. Uh, this way. Skirt! Uh, this way. Skirt! Oh, fuck. Where am I? Oh, I know where I am. Oh, my God. There's so many of these fuckers. Yuka, I mean, are you... Whatever you're in Yuka, you ain't got time, bro. We gotta go, go, go. Oh, shit. Uh, I don't trust any of these doors. Oh, here's the conga line. Oh, fuck my ass. Don't be over here. Oh, shit. Good. Run. Go, 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 go. Come on. Oh, shit. Take it, take it, take it. Go, 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 go. Oh, shitty fucking titties. Save! Wait, can he get over that? Ah! <laughs> fuck you! I'm out! See ya! He's not chasing me, is he? Oh shit, he's still on my ass! Oh god! Oh for fucks, leave me alone! Oh no. Am I Do I trust her? Fuck, fuck it. You better not fuck me. You better not fuck with me. Oh, okay, that's the way to go. Run, 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 run. Oh shit! Ouch! All right. Okay, so if Shiki goes mad here, I'm, I'm gonna skip it. All right, guys. So I was just skipping through the dialogue, thinking it was all the same, and then this popped up. Apparently. Now I can decide if Kishinuma goes back. Now we know what happens if he doesn't go back. He fucking he he succumbs to the darkening. So we are gonna go back. She says, "Come on, for Machida," because oh, fuck, I feel bad for Kishinuma. I really do. But 
Fine, damn it. We'll go back after all. I skipped the dialogue, so I don't know if there's anything new, and I apologize for that. I don't have a lot of real friends. I hate to lose the ones I do. What's that? What are you mumbling about? Ayumi, don't act like you're this. I see the true side of you, Naomi. Ayumi, sorry. Nothing. Nothing at all. Alright, so I was hoping I could see Miki just once more, but I guess I'll have to put that aside. And I also found out through researching... Hold on. Oh, man, we're bumping! Um, I found out through researching that there are multiple endings, so whatever ending I get is the ending we get. I'm not playing this... A game really has to capture me in order to make me do all the endings. Like Detroit Become Human, damn, this is bumping. Uh, like Detroit Become Human, which I didn't record, I played that on my own. Uh, I got all the endings because that game was so fun. All right, so again, I'm going to uh, skip ahead and, until we find something new. All right, guys, so I was just about to leave the room and Yuki stopped me and she says, I'm sorry, I really am, but I wish you the best of luck. This is something I think Shatashi and the others may need. If you find them, please give it to them for me. What is it? Acquired a marble statue. Hmm? Why don't you give it to them yourself? Are you an idiot? Because she's following them around the school right now. I can't, can't get close enough. There's another statue like it though. I will one. If you find it, make sure they get that one too. Understood. The three of us are prepared for the challenges ahead now that our tongues have been restored. But due to the momentum, momentary awakening, the balance of these close spaces have begun to collapse. Be very, very careful. Also, remember, in order for Sachiko to feel remorse, you must appeal to her humanity. You must purify her soul. It's the only way. My mind has already come under attack. So, the next time you see me, run. She's gone. Yeah, for now. Let's focus on finding Satoshi, Miss Yui, and the others. Though, aside from Miss Yui, the only other people we've seen so far are Suzumoto and Moshigi. Moshigi's dead, Suzumoto's dead. Miss Yui did die, but I had the wrong ending going on, so she might live. And when you explode pretty much everywhere, are you sure the others are even there? Here? Well, think about it, remember? The closed spaces? That first ghost we saw told us about them when we got here with Miss Yui. Basically, anyone we can't find is probably in another version of this school. Which is why we never ran into them. Is there something you failed to understand? Damn, she's a bitch! Huh? Uh, no. I... yeah. But wait a minute, if that's the case, how the hell are we supposed to tell them about the murderer? I mean, if we can't even find them. Yuki just told us how. She said the close spaces have started breaking down. I think I'm gonna have to end the episode after this conversation, and next episode we will 100% finish the game. That might mean... Should mean that the connections between the dimensions are changing. So come on, let's try searching for them again. Mishishiro and everyone else. Okay, got it. For real? When I say I got it, I got it! Although, if it's not those children spirits summoning hordes of innocent people to the school and trapping them here until they die, then you kind of have to ask yourself who is responsible, you know? Yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna save. Oh, or not. It, it forced me out. Oh, god damn it. Okay, maybe I am gonna get this episode. <laughs> maybe I can hide from, hide them under here. I can feel air on my... Mm. Oh, she took off her underwear. Because she fucking pissed herself. I can feel air on my... Mm. Feels so weird. But I can't wear them wet like that. It's gross. 
No fuck. Ow. It's been nothing but earthquakes since we got here. I hope the school doesn't fall apart. Alright. <clears throat> okay, Leo, okay, let's get the fuck out of here. Big brother? Big brother! Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Are we them again? Okay. So I'm going to go back in and save, and I think I'll end the episode here. All right, guys, next episode, hopefully we can finish off the game, find out what ending we got, and move on to some more games. Uh, I said at the beginning we would talk about the games, but obviously we're going to talk about that at the very end. So, uh, editing Martin, make sure you cut that out and cut what I'm saying right now out. And, um, yeah, hopefully next episode we can finish the game.